to Bazaar Morning Call. Uh, the latest news flow that just came in is that Blackstone will launch a delisting for our systems at 246 uh, rupees a share. They are committed to buy a majority stake in our systems for 2904 crores. They will buy 52% stake at 245 rupees a share. Satinder Singh Rekhi, who is the CEO of our systems, joins us now to talk about that. Uh, Mr. Reiki, uh, first, if you can just start by telling us what is the rationale for the stake sale and will the promoters continue to run the business? Uh, thank you for having me. The rationale is that uh, we have reached a point and we need a big partner who can take care of the company and take us to the next level of its growth and take care of its employees, customers and partners. Blackstone is a great partner that they are very good, employee-friendly with their other portfolio companies. And that's why we wanted to partner with them. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, will the promoters continue to run the business in any way? If not, uh, what is the next plan of action? And the promoters will be involved. Okay. How it uh, unfolds, we will know as we go along. Okay. I'm definitely going to be involved. Okay. Uh, hi, sir. Oh, good morning. Um, you know, t tell us you're going to be involved in what, uh, you know, in what manner as of now? Uh, as of now, you're running the business. Post uh, the takeover, then what is your role? I, I will certainly be a strategic advisor to them. Mm -hmm. And uh, as we go along, uh, the role will develop a little more. Blackstone has a lot of expertise, so that has to be utilized into the company. All right. Mm -hmm. Sir, you know, you've done this deal with Blackstone, but were there other suitors? Uh, were there any co other companies that approached you? Were there other financial institutions that did put in their bid? Yes, they did. Tell so us. We selected Blackstone because we found that uh, they are very employee friendly mm -hmm. and uh, they build good relationships. So it was a it was an easy choice. But who who were the other suitors in terms of companies? Could you give us a sense? Uh, you know, who were they or? Uh, were there more number of PEs that were uh, trying to come in there and pick up the company? All of the above, but I think mm. it's probably not appropriate to give names of those companies. Yeah, okay. They won't like it. Okay, okay, not appropriate to give names. Just coming back to the rationale, you said you reached a point where you needed a larger company to perhaps come in and take over. Uh, but, you know, IT companies are in the midst of a big digital transformation wave. Why sell now? It is. And it is a, you see, it's always a dilemma mm. whether you do it when it, the wave is going up mm. uh, or other times. But uh, uh, looking at it inside, I think we needed a stronger partner mm. because we are going to get into larger customer bases. So mm. that required a, a heavy weight mm. along with us. Okay. Uh, so is th in terms of delisting, right, yeah. is this a conditional delisting in the sense what if the open offer fails to get you 90% stake, then what is uh, plan B? All that will unfold as we go along. I, I don't think we'll get every information at this moment of time. Uh, you know, uh, so also the entity that's buying you, they own emphasis as well. Do you see some kind of synergy benefits out there? Definitely, but I, I think that they want to keep these separate. Oh, okay. Okay. You said that you will continue to be a strategic advisor and play a role, but what do promoters plan to do with the proceeds that come in? Oh, we don't know as yet. Mm. Okay. Okay. Uh, just one more question before I toss it back to Nigel. Uh, in terms of the business, right, trying to understand, you said you needed a stronger player to come in. Uh, if your margins are much lower compared to a lot of your peers. Uh, what is the prognosis now going ahead? You see, we have an infrastructure. If the revenue rises, the margins will rise. If we get larger deals, margin will rise. So that is one of the strategic goals. All right, uh, Mr. Reiki, we'll leave it there. Thank you very much for your time. Uh, great speaking with you and uh, good luck uh, now that you've uh, struck this deal with uh, Blackstone. We'll, of course, catch up with you once uh, this starts to materialize. I mean, the process starts moving forward, as you said. We'll know a lot of things then. Uh, let's. Uh,